Dallas Keiko doesn't get a lot of attention but he can flat out pitch this year his numbers are up a little bit the ERA is kind of elevated for him last year he had a 199 earned run average for the season and he's a guy that's going to elicit a lot of soft contact he is the best at throwing ground balls they'll turn a lot of double plays behind him the shed launches this ball into right center field but it's playable for Leori Garcia for out number two so the gave it a ride but for a loud second out one two swing and a miss on a sinker to strike him out Toronto goes one two three in the first Hyunjin Ryu faces the White Sox for the first time Buck in his big league career yeah it's kind of surprising he's pitched a long time and this is the first time he will start against Chicago this will be his 12th start of the season Jermaine Mercedes hard hit to left field and over the head of Goriel. Mercedes into second base. Goriel looked like a wind sock out there in left field. The Sox will take the double. Here's the cleanup man, Jose Abreu. One for eight so far in the series. 1 1 to Abreu, ripped into the right field corner, and the Sox will take the lead. Jose, a laser to right. And it's one zip. That's the start of a good night, Mr. Stone. Yasmani into right. This is gone. Two run homer. Just like that, it's three nothing. First pitch swinging. It was uh, just laying in wait for one to drive. And it's three nothing White Sox. And now one up the middle. Panic will play it on a bounce and on to first in time as Andrew Vaughn is retired to bring the inning to a close but a rough start here tonight for the Blue Jays if he's making his pitches and the Blue Jays are over aggressive or trying to pull everything he could have himself a good night swing and a miss strike three second strikeout for Keuchel one two home swing and a miss on a cutter off the inside Keuchel has faced six Blue Jays he's retired all of them Keiko this year actually is a reverse split guy. Lefties hitting him better than righties. Not that unusual. One and two on panic. The pitch swing and a miss. He struck him out on a changeup. So Keiko has a strikeout pitch working tonight. He has fanned four of the seven he's faced. Strike three. Cutter inside. Five strikeouts for Dallas. Eight up, eight down. Blue Jays without a hit to this point. A stretch and a 2-1. On the ground to third, charged by Moncada. He'll throw to first, and that'll do it. Still no hits for the Blue Jays. Mercedes pumps this ball to center field on a 3-2 from Ryu. I think Mercedes has found a home in the lineup against lefties in the two spot. Mercedes at first, one down. 3-2 is there for strike three called. Back door to the cutter, two down. 2 2 change up that Abreu reaches for. Slow roller to short. Simeon flips to panic covering to force Mercedes. And the inning is over. The White Sox will leave a man on. Blue Jays down three to nothing at the end of three. Bichette in the air, first base side. Abreu over the shoulder. Wow. Look, it's a great catch, but that's an easier play for Danny Mendick <laughs> than it is for Jose. He's so good on pop ups that he does these things. A really quick two outs in the Blue Jay fourth, only three pitches. Now Teoscar Hernandez, who grounded out his first time up. He swings at the first pitch and flares it softly into right field for a base hit. He will stop at first, and that's the first knock for the Blue Jays tonight. Runner at first, two down. There's a deep drive to center. Engel, already playing deep, moves back a couple more steps. Makes a catch right in front of the warning track. Ground ball to short. Simeon to panic one. On to Guerrero two as Vaughn grounds into a double play. So that helps the cause uh, of Hyunjin Ryu. 2-0 swung on grounded to short. It's been a busy night for Simeon there. And he'll make the play flawlessly to get Engel. And the side is retired. Three to nothing. White Sox at the end of four. Guriel struck out his first time up. Five strikeouts for Keiko. One, two. Swing and a miss. Cutter beat him. Wow. Six strikeouts to tie a season high for Keiko. So first and second, two down. Simeon has grounded out to short and grounded out to third. 
One one line pass to diving Mendick into center field rounding third and heading home is panic he'll score Espinal around a third and an RBI single by Simeon and the Blue Jays are on the board now trailing three to one. Oh wave and a miss and a fist pump from Grandal on a changeup. Strikeout number seven the Jays get a run. <laughs> 3-2 and a ground ball base hit into left center. Anderson the shortstop was playing Blatty over in the hole so a leadoff base hit in the sixth. Or strike three. Cutter again. Michael his eighth strikeout tonight. And it was the perfectly placed cutter in on the right hander. To third. Moncada. Round number two. There, there's a double play there. Yoan thought that was the third out. Yeah, he absolutely lost track of the outs. Wow. And instead of being out of the inning, you've got Guerrero at second base. Keichel is, he, yeah, he's going, what, what are you doing? 2 2 and a ground ball into left center field for a base hit. Guerrero will come in to score. Again, Anderson playing way in the hole, and the Blue Jays are within a run. There it is. Adams pops it up. You've got three White Sox in the area. It'll be caught by the center fielder Engel. So the Jays get one. They do strand a couple. Nine outs to go against a very tough offensive club. Evan on for the 23rd time. A man on, nobody out. Seventh inning, 3 2 White Sox. Here's the pitch. Ground ball to short. Could be two. And it will be a double play. Anderson to Mendick. To Abreu, and they turn it. Way late on a breaking ball, and Evan Marshall is riled up. Adam Engel has bounced to the shortstop twice. 0 for 7 in his fourth game back from the I.L. Another 2-2 on the way, and a drive in the air. Deep left center. It will go. That's his first hit of the season. An insurance home run. Here in the seventh. Jose Abreu, who was one for three tonight, had an RBI double way back in the first. Hard hit through the left side. That's a long run for Guriel. Maybe Tim can get home. Super Joe's waving him around. Here comes Tim. He is there. It's five to two. Tim's out of gas. The Sox are up by three. Got a new pitcher coming into ball game, and he's coming on with every intent to pick up his 16th save in 18 opportunities. Liam Hendricks, 178 ERA, 40 strikeouts, just three walks. 2-2. Two -two. Slider, ring him up, and the Sox have won the series. Liam Hendricks gives everything again.